everybody welcome to the channel I'm Craig and today we've got a couple mystery boxes to open up one of them's a real mystery I have no clue where it came from I didn't well I know where it came from but I didn't order it so I'm a little surprised anyway we will get to those and more right after this All right, we're back, and uh, first off, I uh, want to say subscribe if you can. We'd love to have you around watching these. Hit that bell notification if you want to be notified of the next video I'm putting up. And uh, let's go with what I always do at first, hi to the post office people, and hi to all my grandkids, because I know they're watching. All right, today we've got uh, two boxes. One is from Papa's Pop Shop, which is kind of surprising because... I didn't order anything from them, at least that I know of. The other one is from uh, J Navo Toys. J, J Navo Toys, you may have seen me open up one or two of their boxes before. I did order some more from them, so I'm uh, looking forward to opening those up. But first, let's get to this uh, Papa's Pop Shop. It is a single box. Um, I don't want to put the addresses on there, so I won't show you that side but I don't know what this is whoops I did show it I guess uh, I don't know what this is um, I, or I order a lot of stuff from them and I went back to my receipts and I couldn't find anything that I had ordered so let's open it up and see what it is uh, I may have just messed up my records if you will or usually I keep fairly good track of stuff I order um, couldn't find anything in my seats or anything, so we shall see what this is. Well, whatever it is, they packaged it in a box in a box. A sorter. Alright, what do we got? We have, oh, a Freddy Funko as the Merman. Huh, Freddy... I'm not sure why I got this one. I mean, I'm happy to have it. Heck, you see up here, I, I love my Freddy's. Uh, I'm wondering if maybe I got this by mistake. Yeah, you meant to send it somewhere else. I'm going to pause this, and I'm going to go try to contact him uh, real quick on Instagram. All right, folks, I'm back, and uh, I did get a hold of uh, the folks over there at uh, Papa's Pop Shop, and they did send me this. Uh, I did not order it. They said it was uh, to replace uh, something that I got, and I don't remember what it was, but I said, okay. Um, so we have Freddy Funko as the Merman. And like I said, I really like these Freddy Funko Pops. Um, I'm happy to have them. And this is uh, limited to 5,000, I believe. I don't think that's a really expensive one, but hey, any Freddy's a good Freddy as far as I'm concerned. I will show you the prices at the end of this, uh, so I'll get back to that one. Anyway, uh, the next thing I have today is from J. Navo Toys, and you can go to their website, jnavotoys.com. I'll put all that info below, and I'll put uh, Papa's Pop Shop info below. And I also put in 83 Pop Talk, because uh, they're the ones that did that uh, the graphics on that intro I had for you all. Uh, I want to thank them for that. So let's open this one up. We'll do it from the bottom. Um, I, well, I do have the info on this. Hold on, and I'll be right back with the info. All right, let's get uh, to this and show you. It should be on the screen now. I can't see the screen, so I'm not sure what you're seeing. I think you should see me down here in the corner somewhere. But this is uh, from J. Navo Toys. It's called Wacky and Wild Wednesday Damage Box. What we're looking for is the SDCC Glow in the Dark Billy. Um, that's from the uh, movie Saw, I believe. Um, this is a $55 box. It's guaranteed $60 to $500 value. And that's not too bad. Uh, three to five pops per box. And we are looking for the uh, Billy in this. Uh, this is a picture of the um, everything there. 
that they have. Well, you should get one of those, I believe they said in there. Uh, one of the picture pops. There's a saw down there. And that's a little closer view. All right, so let's go back here. Um, should be back at this point. And now we can get to opening this thing. All right. Let's see what we got. We're looking for saw, huh? And I'm not a horror fan, uh, but I think that thing's valued around $500, 400 and something. I'd take that in a heartbeat. Wouldn't complain. Okay, so in this box we have four pops. So I don't think we hit anything big. Let's, uh, let us... Oh, they're packed in there pretty good. Okay, we'll do the first one. I didn't feel anything in a protector. Oh, there is one in a protector. Okay. We got one. We'll do that one last. One in a protector. We'll do it last. I don't know why I always put that way down there. I should bring in a stool or something to set these boxes on so I'm not leaning off to the side. Anyway, so the first one we have is the Flash DC Superheroes. I do have the Flash. Um, so actually, I have a... The other one I got, the other Flash, the other day. Anyway, the Flash, there we go. This is, I believe, just common. And let me see the box condition on this. Oh, well, there's a... You can see the back there. Hopefully that focuses in. All right, the box looks pretty good. I don't see any damage to it. No damage at all. Just, no, looks good. Okay, we'll go to the next one. Okay, this one's a little heavier. Don't know what it is. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, an Amazon exclusive. This is the Pharaoh. Pharaoh. It's not Pharaoh, it's Pharaoh, it looks like. From Overwatch. And I've never played Overwatch game, so I don't know much about it. There's uh, some of the line there. Let's look at the box. Box looks, box looks great. Box looks really good. Okay. Put that down here. The next one we have is one, two, three. Michael Jordan. All right. This is him in his uh, Bulls outfit, the red uniform. I do have a few of these. I'm not sure if this is the one I have. Uh, and I think I just sent one to my grandson. One or two of these Michael Jordans. I'm not sure if this is the one I sent to him. This one does have a little damage on it. It's got this. the windows rounded here. And that happens a lot on these pops. I don't know why. It is a Target exclusive. I didn't mention that. But you can see up here on the corner, this box looks is a little damaged up here. It's not much. Um, looks like I could... Probably just, oh, there you go. See, almost fixed already. There you go. See, some type of, oops, sorry. Just got to work, work it a little bit, it's, but it does have the, the little thing up here. Nothing bad, but definitely not the mint box, but it looks pretty good. All right. So now let's get to our final one. This one is, no, it's not a protector. I thought it was, sorry. Not a protector. One, two, three. Oh, it's uh, Thor. I didn't. I just do a several boxes in search of Thor. <laughs> this is a looks like a glow in the dark uh, 2018 summer convention limited edition glow in the dark Thor. I have no idea of value of this, but I was looking for Thor in a couple of other boxes. This has. Just a, a small little bend here. I don't know if you can see it in the light. It uh, certainly isn't bad, but it. Let's see, nah, you can't really tell. Uh, but other than that, this box looks really good. It's got a little bend right here. All right, so let's uh, go and check some prices, and I will be right back with you. All right, everyone, I'm back with some prices here, and. Let's just start with this uh, Freddy Funko that I got, which was very nice from uh, Papa's Pop Shop. 
wasn't expecting it, but uh, just so you know, the value on this, the Merman Freddy, is $28. Not expensive pop, but one that's greatly appreciated, because I always like to have those Freddy Pops. Then we'll go to the uh, J Navo Toys box, uh, and uh, you know, I like this company. I do have another box here that I'll open probably on the next video. Uh, it's the same thing, but I didn't want to take up too much time on this video. We'll start with the uh, Farah. It's Amazon exclusive. The Farah is running at $6. Next we'll go to the Flash. There are a lot of Flashes out there. The Flash, this one is running at $10. They do have a Chase version, the same one. The Chase version is metallic. And that one is running at $160. Just so you know. But this one is the $10 version. All right, so the next thing we have is Michael Jordan. Um, now, Michael has some damage on the box. Not a ton, but enough, you know. So you got to, not taking that into account, this is a Target uh, exclusive. Michael is running at $23. These Michael Jordan pops uh, do hold their value pretty good, it looks like. And the last one, this Thor. Now, I could not find the glow-in-the-dark uh, one on uh, Pop Price Guide so to show the glow-in-the-dark. Again, Pop Price Guide has changed things, and I'm not sure how to do a few things on it. They did have the uh, Summer Convention uh, sticker on one, and it's showing $23. It looks like the exact same pop, uh, so it probably does glow-in-the-dark, glow in but they just didn't put uh, show that on there. To make sure, I went to the Funko app, I scanned the barcode on this, and it was showing the same thing. No glow-in-the-dark sticker, but it did show the same price on it, $23, $23 for Thor. So again, this was a $55 box I paid for, $60 guaranteed value. Uh, we did not get the saw in this box. I do have another one to open up next video. Uh, total price without the Funk Freddy Funko, leaving that one out because that was totally different. But on the, uh, the, um, this box for $55, I got $62 back in value. So not too bad. Uh, didn't, that's not including shipping. I, I don't remember what shipping was or if it was included or not. I, I didn't check. I think I probably had to pay it. But anyway, that's it for this video, folks. Uh, hopefully, I'll have some more stuff for you shortly. I got a lot of boxes coming in. And just a little tease, I did happen to pick up a, a Pop King Paul $200 mystery box that should be here. I just got it two days ago, so it's going to take a week or two for it to get here, but that'll be fun to open up. All right, folks, we'll talk to you all later. Bye.